Okay, I was done doing videos for the weekend. My friend of B just uh, sent me, I'm not going to say the last name for privacy, but sent me a message to let me know to check the Yahoo main page, just checked. And uh, as I've been saying, uh, the Antichrist, Obama, and his cohorts, even though France told Israel they wouldn't sign a bad deal, just signed a uh, deal with Iran on their nuclear program. And Prime Minister Netanyahu, who said yesterday and the day before and the day before that, that Iran will not get a nuclear weapon, uh, he came out and said that uh, this is an early Christmas present for Israel that this treaty is signed. So that tells me Israel is getting ready to strike Iran any time now, which tells me that could be the catalyst for the Isaiah 17 prophecy to be fulfilled, where Damascus is laid to waste and is no longer inhabitable which could trigger the Psalm 83 war with all of Israel's neighbors being angry, which could trigger the Gog-Magog war where uh, Gog, Putin of Magog, Russia, and all the other countries come down and try to attack Israel. <coughs> My friends, time is close. The rapture is imminent. Be ready to go. Get ready to go any second of any day. Jesus Christ is going to break the skies. Are you ready? If not, if you've never been saved, or if you're a backslider and you believe the lies of once saved, always saved, I've got all the scripture that proves that you're wrong. I've got 250 scripture. Message me. I'll send it to you. And you need to repent as well as those who have never been saved. It's time to pray right now before you get left behind in seven years of hell on earth that's going to that's gonna just kill the majority of the population of the world and it's going to make the rest of them feel like they wish they would die. Terrible, terrible stuff on the way, my friends. Do you want to go to heaven or be left behind? Let's pray. Jesus, I know I've sinned. I've done bad things in my life, and I'm sorry. I believe you came to earth. I believe you died on the cross for my sins. I believe you rose again the third day, went back to heaven to be at the right-hand side of the Father to make a place in heaven for all your children forever. Please forgive me of my sins. Wash my heart white as snow. Come live in my heart. Make me a new creature in Christ, a child of the King. In your precious name I ask you. Amen. I pray this prayer. Jesus says that all who come to me and ask shall be saved. When you get saved, to get you a King James Version Bible. It's the living, breathing Word of God. It will feed your spirit and soul the way you feed your body with food and water every day. Pray to Jesus every day. He loves you. He's your new best friend. He wants to talk with you every day. Get dunked underwater, baptized as soon as possible. If you're sprinkled baptized in the past, it doesn't count, my friends. Do it over again. Pray be filled with the Holy Spirit, sanctified from head to toe by praying, living for Jesus, reading the Bible every day. Take that Bible to church at KJV. And when the preacher speaks, make sure it matches your Bible. If not, get up and walk out and find someone else to worship. And lastly, repent, repent, repent. Every time you sin after you're saved, repent. If you want to go to heaven, if you want to be raptured. If you'd like me to pray for you for anything, from paternal illness to a sick pet, anything in between, contact me. I have the gift of faith, mustard seed faith. I didn't earn or deserve it. Praise the Lord when I prayed for it, he gave it to me. And if you ask me to, I'll pray for you every day, expecting a miracle in your life, knowing that God will perform that miracle if it's in his holy will. If he does, it's all because of him, nothing to do with me. I'm the least in his kingdom, a tiny fish in a huge ocean, a slave for Jesus Christ. Understand, my friends, if Israel attacks Iran, which they're probably about to do, it's going to isolate them around the, uh, the entire world as a rogue nation. The Bible says in the last days, Israel will stand alone. Keep witnessing and praying, my friends. Time is short. The rapture is imminent. I love you guys. May God bless you. Have a blessed evening. Bye.